हेलो एवरी वन एंड वेलकम टू जैक एजुकेशनल चैनल सो दिस इज रिगार्डिंग द एग्जाम पेपर एनालिसिस दैट इज द रिव्यू फ्रॉम द स्टूडेंट्स विच वी आर गेटिंग आफ्टर द यू जी सी नेट डिसम्बर ट्वेंटी ट्वेंटी वन एंड जून ट्वेंटी ट्वेंटी टू पेपर फॉर द एनवायरमेंटल साइंसेज सो हियर वी विल डिस्कस बोथ फॉर पेपर वन एंड पेपर टू हाउ वॉज द एग्जाम वट आर द स्टूडेंट्स रिव्यू एंड वट विल अफेक्ट द कट ऑफ थिंग्स सो दिस ऑल थिंग्स आर इम्पॉर्टेंट सो विदाउट मच डीले लेट्स गेट स्टार्ट best thing to know about the exam difficulty and everything is to know from the students as i have said earlier so we'll know from the freshers as well as those who are preparing for two or three years from them also because that will give us an hint that what will be the cut off and what will be the score for qualifying jrf or net for this time so starting with anjana who is from masters in environmental science this was her first attempt and what is her review for the exam so she is telling that for the paper one it was easy to moderate level calculations were easy and she did guess work for teaching aptitude and the information and communication technology was also easy for her so make sure this was for first attempt and she is telling paper one was easy to moderate level calculations were easy and according to her paper 2 was moderate to difficult level because obviously it is her first attempt it will be looking bit difficult but it will be moderate around time management she was telling that i could complete first reading of paper 1 in 45 minutes attempting 70% of questions and second reading in 15 to 30 minutes so time management was also not an issue she was able to do twice reading of the paper 1 and di and rc that is data interpretation and reading comprehension of paper 1 di was again easy as per her i could get answers of most of them so most of them she were able to answer them correctly so that's a good sign and reading comprehension was also easy but some questions two or three were bit tricky so there there would have been a bit more time invested so let's move to the next comment coming from anjana maximum portions were from environmental impact assessment environmental laws and convention and statistics portion so this is the thing given by anjana and overall paper review is that it was the moderate level based on both paper 1 and paper 2 and last statement is very important i could have done better with decent coverage of syllabus so those who have done decent coverage of syllabus they would have done very well because she is telling that she could have done better with decent coverage of syllabus so this was her first attempt i am repeatedly saying and this is her review regarding the examination This is Manisha Das and I am a research scholar from NIT Rawalpindi. So I was preparing for UGC NET JRF since 2020 and this was kind of my third attempt. So talking about uh, this current attempt, paper was like easy to moderate and for the um, in paper one DI was easy and maximum of the questions were from the previous year. For paper two, I will say like the questions were kind of moderate and uh, was. literally tough for me to manage both preparations for ugc with the phd work lab etc for this i completely want to thank jackly team for his complete full time support even if i talk about myself i have only gone through their quiz session which personally helped me a lot during the last minute exam preparation maximum questions were from the quiz itself which helped me uh, to recall and remember Uh, some important points which is most important in the exam he cleared doubt whenever we asked and most important is mock test like the questions in the mock test covered all the units including the previous year and some additional tricky questions which is the best thing i found in this classes so let's see let's hope for the best and all the best to everyone for the result thank you unlike the previous year the pattern of questions which is set this year for both environment science and for the paper 1 i felt it was a bit different any frequent pattern of questions which is asked past few years which was not there this year um and again for paper 2 and in the environmental sciences the calculation part was actually less but the Uh, uh you know uh, based on equations such calculations was very less they were giving more focus to statistics in both paper 1 and paper 2 i felt and uh, the usual questions in uh, paper 2 like uh, related to pollutions color code all those question was actually less 
and uh, regarding color codes um, there was nothing the, not even a single question and the uh, gaussian plume model which used to be a regular question everywhere at least two times in a question paper that uh, question comes every year but uh, that was not there so such conventional pattern was broken down actually this year so unless and until you have a good uh, subject knowledge i mean at least a general knowledge uh, just gulping down uh, answers will not work this time that's for sure uh, so people who have done that way definitely would have found this question paper very difficult uh, otherwise yeah it was a simple paper and this is the poll which was conducted in our telegram channel and according to the poll maximum students were telling that overall paper 1 and paper 2 was easy to moderate level so this is the maximum students were telling out of the 434 vote and till now it will be 500 plus so here accordingly the second question given in our poll in the telegram group was what is your opinion on paper 1 and paper 2 and maximum students said the option that paper 1 was easy and paper 2 was bit difficult so it is coming same as per as the other candidates those who have spoken for the review of this year's paper so this is the poll which i wanted to tell you so accordingly it was given in our telegram channel so after listening to everyone every kind of students freshers as well as those who are preparing for two or three years I am having my own personal review for this year's paper because I didn't go to exam but I am having the analysis after talking to so many students. So paper 1 as per me was DI and reading comparison was easy which will be the game changer in this year's examination. So this will be a game changer as I used to say every time because those who have done maximum questions correct in these two they will be having the edge over other students. Next calculations was easy in paper one also this is also a green signal that's why it is in green color in this slide and ICT was also easy but the negative thing that means the red symbol is it will need more than 30 questions correct if you want to qualify for JRF that is the analysis done by me for the paper one you should at least have 30 plus around questions correct out of 50 in paper one. So let's see about paper 2. Paper 2 after going through all the reviews and analysis I am telling that many previous years questions and concepts were asked but yes it was in a bit twisted form but many previous years questions were repeated which we already did in our revision series and quizzes. So less numericals were asked and very very frequently asked questions such as the sulfur dioxide conversion and BOD questions those two are very chocolate numericals which we already did several times and one other green signal was there more from the pollution unit EIA and statistics. So this pollution units EIA and statistics many questions were asked from there those who have done well revised them well they would have done definitely well in these sections and the only thing which is red I have given here is that many multiple options type questions were there which were a bit tricky not directly asked so this is the only thing which will decide otherwise everything was green 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 in the paper 2 also so now I will tell you about the cutoff thing so the cutoff thing this I will give you a single message given by one of our students so as per that students exam to acha gaya bahut sare questions aa rahe the but students bata rahe hain un sab ka bhi paper acha gaya so most of the students are telling that paper was good for them and this is indicating that cutoff kafi high jayega is bar so this is the prediction that cutoff will increase this time but what will be the exact or what will be the prediction for cutoff I will make a separate video when the answer keys are released so for that you have to wait till the time answer keys are released I have to go through the answer key answer paper and after the analysis I can only tell because last time also we predicted and our prediction came pretty close to the correct cutoff which we predicted so this thing you have to wait for and now no need to worry about these things so pray 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 and let's hope for the best see you guys in our next video I hope you have learned something about the analysis of the paper how it is done not simply talking in one slide so this was done with the help of so many students thanks to each one of you see you guys in our next video till then keep smiling and believe in yourself